The one and the only triple the G, yo, D. Yo, my hero academia, one justice, which you have no idea about. I would, because we, we had this conversation before we came down to the lab. It's simple. Do not watch the anime. The anime is really good. Read the manga. Read it. I don't know if the spots where we used to do dirt still exist because I haven't read a manga in years. I'm like, after, because what, what was the last thing we really read was, what ended first? Because I think Naruto ended first. No, Bleach ended first, then Naruto did, right? No, Naruto ended first, then Bleach. Okay. Hmm, damn. I don't know why I brought back up that memory. Fuck. I yeah, should have done that. That wasn't a good idea. But yeah, the anime, anime kick ass. Anime is off the chain. I've watched season one. I'm like, season three about to come out, so I'm going to sit down and watch season two or whatever. That do My Hero Academia don't come on Toonami or anything? No. Damn. No, they, they, they got the JoJo, but not the My Hero Academia. That's kind of weird. So, you don't even know what the hell you about to even see. Do you want a brief synopsis about what My Hero Academia is about? Well, I'm pretty sure it will benefit the uh, audience too. Well, most of the people who, who who come through and do what we listen to us do what we do, they know what it is. So I think for the sake for those who don't and you, all right, it's about training superheroes. Mm -hmm. There's this kid named Deku. He his he has a real name that I don't really care about pronouncing right now. We'll just call him Deku. Like, he was a kid, okay, damn, I just lost it. Okay, let's try this again. All right, in the world of My, my Hero Academia, people are born with things called quirks, which are superpowers. Mm -hmm. There are, most people have them, and some people just do not. Mm -hmm. Our boy Deku is someone who doesn't. He wants to be a superhero so bad that he'll do anything to be a superhero, but he ain't no superhero because he ain't got no quirk. Mm -hmm. One day, he was courageous enough to do what other people wouldn't, and then the superhero he always admired passed on his quirk to him, which is called One for All, which means the more motherfuckers believe in you, the harder you can punch shit. That's just the general synopsis. And then he meets, he goes to the, the Hero Academy. He meets friends. There's this Frog Bay girl and there are some other things that happen. It's dumb. It's really, really dumb in like a great way. And if you want to cheat and watch the anime, I don't care. But I really think they're trying to get caught up to the manga and then watching the anime to see the things that they slightly alter because it is the anime will probably be the best way to handle that, so. That's about the general synopsis. Kid who has no powers does something really heroic. Then his suit, his his idol gives him the superpower that he was once given, and then you know now you can punch things. Okay. With or you, which are usually names of states. Detroit Smash. Yeah, that's one of that's one of the kids' moves. He punches a motherfucker and screams, "I'm from the D it's cold in the D, bitch!" and and punches a motherfucker in the face. All right. Yeah. Sounds sounds intriguing. Yeah, yeah. it is. All right. Sue you is bang, but that that you you will understand about frog pussy later. Frog pussy is very important to my hero academia, but frog pussy is important. Just putting it out there. So now that we've established punching people, saying it's cold in the D, and frog pussy, that if you give me one second, we are going to get started right about now. I need to. Need to mute the damn thing and whatever the hell, cause I'm like, you can't activate trailer.exe with it acting this dumb, stupid computer. Alrighty. If you ready to see what's good with it's cold in the D and frog pussy, you let me know and I activate trailer.exe. Alright, let's go. Alright then, trailer.exe activate, bitch. May contain inappropriate content for children. You knew that when you came here. You knew this. Alrighty. That's, that's Izuku Midoriya, our hero. Okay, I'm okay, I'm with this right here. My hero wants justice. That's Bakugo right there. Yeah, he, he got fire and ice. There go, uh, I'm like, it's going, it's going to 
see, yeah, and Quark showed you. One for all right there, see? Detroit Disposia! Koski Bakugo, boy. He, he, yeah, Todoroki, though. He he firing ice. He's like his mom and daddy some weird shit. Um, that, the streets love her. That he he supposed to. That's Bay right there. That's Bay. That's Bay. Yeah, that's um Dicky right there. Electric man. Momo. She sits up her. She can pull shit out of hammer space or whatever. Okay, sidekicks. Is. Man, okay. I'm gonna talk about this after this trailer over, but this look kind of dope right here. So this just this just okay. You know, I'm I'm gonna say it. I'm gonna say it. I'm gonna say it. Damn. They throw it. This look fucking sick, though. My Hero Academia, one justice. Oh, stay. Stay this. Mm. Yeah, the first major villain right there, Tom, and that's all my. That's the dude that gave Deku his power, or whatever. I told you this shit was dope, and you see, it's coming out on every damn thing, yo. Everything. Like, if there's a system that plays a video game, this shit is coming out on it. Told you this shit look mad fucking dope, son. Mad dope. So, so, so now, so now it, it's time for you to start reading it and trying to get caught up on this My Hacker Academia. Maybe once you, once you get done getting caught up on a manga or something, or you want to watch the first two seasons of the anime, nigga, we can, we can, we can do, we can do, um, we can do a trigger nigga episode about My Hero Academia if you're down with doing it. Okay. All right. Cool. That was dope. I'm glad I'm glad we decided to sit down and do this. You know what I'm saying? It's been a while since we've done this. We're still trying to get the lab together. You know what I'm saying? We're still, still trying to get the lab together. We still got projects. I know it's been a bit of a setback, you know what I'm saying, between YouTube on that bullshit, me being him to fuck up. Shit I'm currently dealing with, it's going to be all right. First of all, have my faith in the almighty horse base God to cripple niggas continually because you fucking with me. Second of all, I'm going to keep robbing and stealing and raping and killing. You gotta do what you know. That's the point. I'm just saying you gotta do what you know. If if what you know is robbing, killing, raping, and stealing, that's what you do to get by, man. All in the name of the horse base. All in the name of horse base. That's what he wants from us, man. Horse base God wants us to rob, steal, rape, and kill. Like that, that 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 show that you give him praise and understand where your blessings come from when you rob, steal, rape, and kill and cripple niggas. Yeah. I'm just saying you got we 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 just like. Right now, from the one and the only to the horse base, I want to give, I want to give praise to you. Thank you for continuing to wake me up every day so I can cripple niggas in your name and rape and steal and rob and kill from them because you can't fuck with me. Live. These beliefs are not my actual beliefs. Please don't believe them because if you do, you full of shit. I'm just saying you are, you awake every day because you haven't expired yet. Also true. So, there you have it. Yeah. So, you let me know what you need to get caught to um to get down on this My Hero Academia shit. You let me know what you need. I got you. Mm -hmm. Um, if you gonna go the manga route, nigga, there is this. I I don't know if you have watched this other shit that I wish they would make a game off of. I don't know if you heard of it. It's called Freezing. I think I might have told you about it a long time ago. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I need them to make a Freezing game right now. Yo, that'll be mad, though. Satellizer El Bridget. Yes, what's really good. Like, yo, that, that, a Freezing game would be fucking dope. But since no one cares about the franchise anymore, I don't see it happening. Decent, decent English dub. You know what I'm saying? The manga, the manga goes in weird places. So it is what it is with that. When we gonna get that air gear game, my nigga? When we gonna get that Tenjo oh, Tenjo game? Never. When, when we gonna get that Tenjo Tenjo game? Never. When we gonna get air gear across Tenjo Tenjo? Never. Nigga? What you mean? That you know what? That's more likely of happening than the standalone film too. <laughs> air gear across across Tenjo Tenjo. Two of old great greatest collide in in roller skate versus karate kick. <laughs> pretty, pretty much. <laughs> pretty <fucking> much, dude. <laughs>
pretty fucking much. Man. That's more likely to happen, though. I'm fucking mad. What the hell? What the hell is going on for? Look, let's go ahead and let's turn it to a video, man. Yo, thank you for joining me, man. Mm -hmm. I appreciate you coming through, Doc. Um, yeah. One L Triple the GOD. John K. I'd like to thank you guys for joining us for another installment of Trigger Niggas, because we stay triggering. Because we niggas and we trigger you, so trigger niggas. I'm like, that's called a compound word, motherfucker. Look it up, nigga. The one and only Triple the GOD, Jock King, thank you for joining us for another installment of Triple the God Speaks On, Class 2 Niggas Speak On, Class Um What? Trigger niggas, Class I don't know what the fuck we making up, nigga. Shout out always to the Lord in Heaven, Horse Base God, making cripples out of niggas, rape, rob, steal, and kill, nigga. Fuck out of my face. Get skittles kebabs. Call at you guys next time, man. Peace out. <laughs> One more thing. One more thing in my uncle voice. Because I had given so much praise to the horse face God about robbing, stealing, raping, and killing. I didn't make the point that I think is really important that probably the streets need to understand. There was this game that came out about a year and a half ago on the 3DS called My Hero Academia Battle for All. That game was mad dope. Like, that game got some tech in it. Like, for real, got some legit tech that I want to show people and I think I may. I just need to just sit down and I need to find my new 3DS XL and I just need to mod it so that I can do that. So if you if, if y'all in the streets ain't played that battle for all joint, y'all need to. Like I got a blog post. If y'all want to get at it, I'll link it in the description. But I really for real see this as like since you know since Naruto is going at old Shinobi Striker route or whatever. Did you play the beta of that at all? No, I did not. Okay, yeah, cause I saw what I, I saw what it was, and I'm kind of like, well, um, I, I just want Clash and Ninja Five. You know what I'm saying? New Geki Toe Ninja Tithing games. Like, you know, hook me up. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Like, I'm not saying that um that the Ultimate Ninja that the Ultimate Ninja Storm games aren't good or anything, but I'm just saying that how much time you got? Why? I can hook up a GameCube right now and we can play Clash of Ninja 2. We can do that right now. No, we can't. Are you sure? I am positive. Can I reschedule that for a later time? Yes, we can. Okay, just want to just make sure. I really like for real. I really like that this game is really like the next step in the next evolution of like the storm games or whatever. Because Cyber Connect Two made the Ultimate Ninja Storm games what they were, and there were a lot of offshoots and spinoffs. The big one being the the Die Hack Versus game, which is really good, and I probably need to play that on the channel for you guys because that game is amazing. Is destructible stuff. It's like. It's really like, really like that first real game because I didn't play Ultimate Ninja Storm 4 and I have no idea if you did. I know Steve did, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I know Steve did. We had to get him on the mic, have him talk about that or something. But I like what I saw, but it's like at this point, I am so distanced from like the anime and the manga ended weird and I don't give a shit about Boruto, but your mom has humongous tits, sir. Don't really care. At all in any way of being invested in your adventure. Mm -hmm. Your dad, your daddy started from the bottom and then he made it and then he became an absentee and ignored you because you a bitch ass son. Why do I want to waste my time reading or watching about you because you's a bitch? Why? Why do I want to do that? I don't. So I don't. I'm like, I've been hearing small rumors that they gonna finally they gonna do the final arc of bleach in an anime form. And it may actually get a proper ending. I've heard things. I think that picture might have been bullshit. But it gives me hope that we can see the end of Bleach maybe the way that we should have. Mm -hmm. I'm like, you still ordering Naruto DVD, so it ain't over in the English dub yet. No, it's not. How close are they to the end? I think uh, about 60 or 70 episodes away. Jesus Christ! A lot of fucking episodes. A lot of fucking episodes. I can't say it's a lot of episodes. Yep. But yeah, I'm like, I like what I see. I'm like, as an evolution of the Ultimate Ninja Storm games, 
I really appreciate that this is that this is the anime that's gonna take it to the next level because One Piece did Burning Blood and that was alright. Like Saint Seiya got a game, but it's the upport of a PS3 game and it's middling okay at best. Um We like Heat the Soul, that's all we got. I want to play Blade Battlers 2, but you need four people to, like, really play that game. Like, we should play Battle Stadium D.O.N. again. Even you said J-Star Victory Versus was fucking garbage. Do you still stand by the statement that that game is fucking garbage? I won't say it was garbage, but I was expecting more from it. Okay. It, it, it kept me entertained for a week or two. Okay. That was about it. Fair enough. Well, no, I'll take that. But yeah, that's all I wanted to say. I, I just wanted to, to give praise to our Lord, the horse based God, and I forgot to, to get out more of, you know, some education to try to figure out what we're going to do. So you are officially on the internet on the hook to play Clash of Ninja 2. So that's why I made you say you agreed to it because now you can't back out. Okay. So we can play that now. So we can do that. Cause I'm like, yo, that that first one we did, that uh, that Geki Toe Nigger Nigger ties in Dagger too, though. That that first one, legendary shit. Like people, they talk about the the Kakashi Aruka battle. They they still talk about that in the streets. Like y'all went heads up on that. They say, yo, that's what they say. They want more, so we gotta give them what they need. Anything else that y'all getting? You know, we gonna keep that to the chest. Trigger niggas, we gonna trigger more niggas. No homo. I don't know if they needed a no homo, but I just wanted to just double check and, you know, make sure. I guess. Yeah, I just want to just make sure that, you know, that I'm covering my bases of no homo. So, that's important. Saying no homo even when no homo needs to be said. Let's turn this into a video for real. Again, I'd like to thank you once again for joining me for this extended, extended look at My Hero Academia Once Justice. Um, again, like I told you off mic, you let me know whatever you, you need to get caught up and I will hook you up and I'll take care of that. Mm -hmm. So for, for real this time, for real, the one and the only, the triple, the G-O-D. Jockey. Thank you guys for joining us for another installment of Trigger Niggas. And with that being said, how about you guys next time? For real this time, not for play play, but for real, real. Sketch Killers Kebabble. How'd you guys next time, man? Pick Sam! <laughs>